A power supply system provides generation, transfer, distribution, and consumption of electricity. Electrical substations are key elements to any power supply system. The basis of any electric substation is power lines, transformers, switches, and a switchboard. Its functionality is to receive, transform, and distribute electric power to consumers. Substations are controlled via their secondary equipment. Secondary equipment includes a variety of sensors and controllers. The major breakthrough for today's electric power industry is that separate electrical and information networks can be effectively integrated into one system. Modern substations increasingly use intelligent devices that can exchange information through digital optical circuits. Such an approach allows for the elimination of expensive copper cable clutters. Many of the existing substations are equipped with obsolete equipment, which needs to be updated. This explains why most of the currently used control systems still require a great deal of secondary equipment for the processing of data received from antiquated measurement transformers. A large amount of secondary equipment at a substation means increased construction, modernization, and operational costs. The partner companies of Profotech and Lysis have come up with a collaborative technology solution that makes it possible to significantly reduce the amount of substation equipment used without limiting or degrading its functionality, thus cutting the costs of the substation's secondary systems. Our solution results in shorter construction time and reduced construction and maintenance costs. Moreover, even non-attended substation solutions are expected to be feasible in the long run. Digital substation is comprised of the following equipment. Primary measuring equipment, utilizing optoelectric technology for data measurement and transfer. A unified substation security and control complex designed as a modular data processing center. Our solution allows a substation to be so compact that all the required equipment can be transported to the site in three cargo vans. As a result, construction costs can be reduced dramatically. Now, all the systems that we got used to seeing as separate boxes, which are automatic process control systems, protective relaying and automation systems, automatic emergency response systems, and so on, have become virtual devices kept in the computer's memory. It allows for the supplying of a substation with only a few boxes containing the functionality of all the traditional equipment. All communications will be carried out only by optical cables. Digital substations provide a basis for the implementation of intelligent networks in Russia and throughout the world.